What is up heroes, this is Midnight Zero, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green. In the last episode, we defeated Blaine, the Cinnabar Island Gym Leader, and made our way to one island, unexpectedly embarking on a side quest, and now we are moving along Kindle Road. And, well, i got a couple things to say. Uh, first of all, I checked out where Kindle Road leads and everything, and this leads to Mount Ember, and we'll be coming back here later in the game. So, I'm instead going to head back to one island and continue this little uh, side quest, embark on our quest to... Island number two, so I'm gonna head all the way back there, but for you it'll just look like instant transmission. Alright, we're back at one island, and let's see, where can we go from here? Let's talk to the sailor. Ahoy there, where do you want to sail? Uh, let's go to two island, because I believe we have to drop off a meteorite to uh, some important people here. So let's take a look, is there anyone over here? Nope. Anyone over here? Nope. The purpose in having those areas is... I don't know. Danger, fast current fishing and surfing prohibited. Okay, so... Can't be doing any of that while we're here. Let's see what this guy has to say about the island. There's an old woman who lives in a cottage out in the Cape. She gives the eye to Pokemon. It's a bit unnerving. Ooh, I wouldn't want to be getting the eye. I'm not really that curious what's behind there, so we're not going to deal with that now. That fellow there, he moved from Seldon City. He started off a shop with his younger brother. I have to wonder if he knew what he was getting into. <laughs> There's like no one here. Merchandise limited, but I hope we can serve your needs. Ooh, great ball and some fresh water. You know, I think I'll pass for now, but I'll support you some other time. I promise. Let's see. Two Island. Boone Island for two. Boone Island for two. Huh, cool. Pretty clever. I'm the Pokemon Move Maniac. <laughs> he knows everything. He's all about the shrooms. Are you sure this isn't like a Mario uh, appearance in a Pokemon game? He's all about the shrooms. Just like Seiko's all about the booty. <laughs> boing boing, have you tried the jumping game? Pokemon you can enter boing. Some go boing. Some go boing. Do you know that? Boing. Gosh. A joyful game corner. Let's see what it's like in here. I love this music. This reminds me of Pokemon Stadium. Oh boy, where has Lostel? Maybe she's lost. <laughs> no, we're not. If you want us to be, I mean. She's a cutie. Oh, I, I want to be your friend then. I need to search three island. Who's this goon? Is this the only three island around here? Oh my gosh. Yeah, why does he have a motorcycle inside? That would not be fun. Oh, I thought we were going to get into a battle. Ah, uh, there's a PC here. I'm sorry, we're not running any games today. Oh, that's so sad. I'm pretty sure you need to be, like, connected to, uh... Um... You need to be connected to a Emerald game or something. Alright, so we'll go to Island 3 to look for Lost L. In a second, though. I need to continue exploring this little island. There isn't much to explore. Cape Brink? What's up here? Oh, I thought we almost made it out without a Pokemon battle. But we got a slow... Oh, level 31. That's actually a really high level. I'm shocked, actually. I guess a decent amount of EXP. Pokemon on these islands are pretty strong. I'm impressed. You're doing well. You're doing well, islands. So, I'll be honest, I'm going through these island quests pretty much blind, because last time I did these quests was like in 6th or 7th grade, which was long, long time ago. I perfected the ultimate move of its type. But will no one take it for future use? Hmm? Hmm? Use that. That Venusaur. Oh, this is the one. This is the Pokemon. This Venusaur is worthy of learning my ultimate move. Will you allow it? Will you allow your Venusaur to learn my frenzy plant? Let's take a look. You'll allow it? Let's take a look. Leaf wants to learn the frenzy plant. I didn't even know that this move existed in uh, this generation, actually. Frenzy plant is 150? Is it special? Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Um, I think it's special. What should we get rid of, though? That's the question. We'll get rid of growth. I don't like that it doesn't tell you if it's special or not. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. Hmm, special attack stat, leech seed, sleep powder. Those are both really helpful. Razor leaf is good for now. You know, let's get rid of growth. This is, uh, <laughs> we're just doing the Pokemon campaign. We're gonna need any boosting moves, really. If this were competitive play, I'd strongly reconsider it, but no. I think I could teach that move while I still lived. 
Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Alright, well, let's see what we got going on in this water. I feel like I'm at the Wisconsin Dells. Woo! -hoo -hoo! <laughs> little water ride. Is there something over here? Is that why there's this little ledge? No? Okay. I guess we're just gonna start surfing again. No Pokemon battles. Cool. Alright, so just like that, let's uh move on to island number three, because apparently there isn't really much going on here. Oh, are you there? No, I don't want to go to one island. So you get from Ash and A. Alright, now let's go to three island. High speed two. Captain, we're about to go ludicrous speed. Luda. Oh, so many bikers. Do they want to battle us? Hey, hey, lady. Fork over some spending money. Oh, man, they're robbing her. Who are you? I'll, I'll call the police. This does not look like a fun place to be. We're the Kanto Rider Federation. Vroom. 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 My bike's movie, so I have to make exhaust noises myself. <laughs> that is so weak. So weak. All right, so there's that cave we can go in. What does it say? Can Island of Family Bonding. Aw, didn't seem so uh, family-oriented right off the bat. What's in this house? Oh, 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 missed the door a couple times, and now we're good. No one's in this house. Maybe that's the lady that's out and about and getting robbed. And we're doing... Whoa! Are you the boss? Go back to Kanto right now! I just got here, pal. What's with the hostile attitude? It's mighty cold of you. Your gang of followers have been raising havoc on their bikes. you have any idea how much trouble they've caused us on the island? No, man. I don't get it at all. Look at this place. What do you do for entertainment? You ought to be thanking us for livening up this sleepy village. But hey, if you insist, you can try making us leave. Grr, you cowards. So tough in a pack. Alright. Let's do this. Um, who do we want to train? Let's train... Nightwing and Karama. Totally feeling like it. Let's battle these guys. What are you saying? Don't you know it's not polite? You want to make something of it or what? Actually, yeah, let's battle. We'll take your money and all that experience. This will help us train for the Elite Four, actually, so I'm looking forward to it. Biker Goon? <laughs> Someone's named Goon? That's unfortunate. What a goon. Oh, he's gonna be your typical bad guy with coughing. All the poison type Pokemon. All the evil looking Pokemon. Even though the Pokemon themselves I don't think are evil. I forget which movie it was. I think it was Pokemon Forever that said that um, all Pokemon are instinctively good. But there was like a Dark Ball you could use that could like capture Pokemon and then like taint their souls pretty much. Oh no, minimize, no! Yuck, I hate Grimer. Well, I actually don't hate Grimer, I hate the fact that it uses minimize. Alright, if I have to go through all these bikers, I'm probably going to end up skipping a bunch of them, because they're going to have the same Pokemon over and over. Oh man, don't you dare laugh! Oh boy. Yeah, I'm going to be going through these guys real fast. Second one down. Four more to go. <laughs> Alright, let's do this! These guys don't even have that many Pokemon. They're, uh, they all just have like one Pokemon, it's like a Coffee or a Grimer. Oh, is this the boss? Alright, let's take on the boss. He's one of the bald cue ball guys. What's he have? A wheezing? And that's much stronger than like one guy had a coughing and one guy had a uh, Grimer. That's it. Ooh, that actually did not do enough. Alright, so let's switch out. Who do we want to send in? Let's send in Karama. Karama could use the EXP, I think, and Flamethrower should do quite a bit of damage. What? Come on, Karama, live to self-destruct. You can do it. Oh my gosh, with what HP? Yes! Alright, now he's level 42. Gosh, self-destruct, really? What is this, Gen 1? Alright, we'll switch out to someone else now. Um, let's go with Rain. Against a Muck. Basically just got leveled up Pokemon of all of his followers. Wonder how many followers he has on Twitter. He's the boss of this stupid gang that's actually gone to some random island that has like 10 people on it and just wreaks havoc. Like, do not have that much of, or like, do you have that little or like that unimportant of a life 
that you can afford to do that. Darn it, I do not want to deal with this minimized shenanigans. You know what, I'm just going to do Parish Song. Screw that. <laughs> no matter what, you're dead, Muck. Just a matter of time now. And yeah, see, I don't want to deal with Minimize. I don't want to worry about hitting him. And he's got relatively high defense, so... Or defenses, so... I'm just not even going to worry about it. I'm going to switch out Rain, because I don't want Rain to die. But I want to split the experience with Bailey for now. So, let's do that. Let's get to talk about... Oh my gosh, guys. I took the best nap today. Naps are so wonderful. They just, like, help you kind of recharge for the rest of the day. And it's amazing how helpful they are. <laughs> I uh, was so tired. I've gotten less than five hours of sleep for the past three nights in a row. So... I just get home every day in the afternoon and I'm just exhausted. I laid on my bed and I was like, you know what? I can afford to take a nap. I can afford to take a nap. So that's exactly what happened. And I am so much better for having done that. Sadly, I have to get up early again tomorrow. But that should be it for a little bit. So, that's okay. And this looks like this muck is about to die. Darn it, we got poison though. Ugh, that's annoying. I haven't seen... Do we see a Pokemon Center? I think... I know there is one, but I don't know where it is. And, alright. Split up that EXP. And we defeated Q-Ball Paxton, the leader. We'll leave like you wanted. We'll be happy to see the last of this boring island. <laughs> Get out of here. Now, I'm, I want to talk to these guys. They're probably going to reward us. Thank you, those goons were nothing but bad trouble. Oh, look, you're pulling my hurt on my account. Full restore, nice. You've got seriously impressive Pokemon with you. Yeah, yeah, I know. It'd be fantastic if someone as strong as you lived here. I hope you'll at least stay here for a while. Big pardon, you're looking for a lost cell? Went up towards Bond Bridge a while ago. Huh, we'll have to check out this Bond Bridge place. Something interesting I found out is that the Pokemon Center theme, like this is the normal one, but on one island, it's slightly remixed or different. I don't know how exactly, but it sounds like almost more chip -tune y Uh, which is, oh, this guy looks like Lieutenant Surge. I want to talk to him. Hey, did you hear the news? The PC Network here can now link with PCs in Kanto. Awesome! I don't know how that came about, but it's fantastic. Does that mean there's something, uh... Oh, wait a minute. Where's that guy in Two Island that we have to deliver that meteorite to? We've still yet... We have yet to find that. What's this little girl doing here? I'm not Lustel. Going to the Berry Forest? So we're talking about Bond Bridge and the Berry Forest. Where are we going, dudes? What are we doing in the Berry Forest? Much talk of the Berry Forest. I guess we're going to end up going there eventually. Pop keeps lying to me and won't let me go out and play. Oh, What does the Pop have to say about it? You must never ever go out to the Berry Forest alone. There are ghosts there? Uh, what if there actually are? We just like encounter some Gastlies or Haunters or something like that. At least there's some... Oh, so here's Bond Bridge. Please be quiet when crossing. I wonder why. Hmm. What do these guys have to say? Oh, uh, cool! It's just like I can't make this spoon bend with my mind. You're not an Alkazam, silly. Or a Cadaver, for that matter. <laughs> Sabrina, she's one of my favorite gym leaders. I admire her too, guys. Don't worry. Join the fan club. This is his first time to say. What's the progress of the islands here? Yeah, <laughs> sometimes it's better boring than bad. I bought this house because I want to live somewhere quiet. Today I think I'll go out fishing. I thought it said you couldn't go fishing or surfing here because the waters were too rough. Or at least that's what I think it said. Alright, let's explore. Darn it. I also forgot that we need to switch our lead Pokemon so we can uh, spread the wealth of experience. Let's get Bailey going. We got a double battle coming up. Oh, I'm surprised we haven't already been like, we hadn't already triggered it. Alright, uh, we'll teach you what our favorite Pokemon is. Oh, <gasps> Joy? Future Nurse Joy? Possibly? Not that bad, each of them just had a uh, Clefairy, so it wasn't that big of a deal. Ooh, I actually like Persian. I don't know why exactly, but I do like the Pokemon. Where are you off to in such a hurry? Gotta find Lost L. Ooh, she's got a Bulbasaur. Might as well show this off at least. I always said I'm I always find it interesting when other trainers have starter Pokemon from this region. 
Or any region for that matter. Oh, it's not very effective. Is grass resistant to electric? Or is poison resistant to electric? I'm not 100% sure. But, oh, I didn't know that was going to happen. Interesting. Still looks like it should be a 3-hit KO, so... Shouldn't take too long to battle. If the rest of her Pokemon aren't that interesting, I'll just kind of skip the rest of it, because... Ugh, you're kidding me, Sleep Powder. Wow, this is going to get real annoying real fast. Let's switch. Go, Kurama! Now, sadly, there's no Sleep Claws in this game. So, he could theoretically use Sleep Powder on all of my Pokemon. Sweet set. What does that do? Lower my special attack, maybe? Or evasiveness? Evasiveness fell. Yeah, that's right. Alright, Flamethrower should do the trick. Would have done the trick right off the bat. But that's okay. Maybe Bailey will get a level up? Probably not, though. It's a, like, first stage Pokemon, so... Yeah. Ooh, an Ivysaur? <gasps> Don't tell me she's got all of the evolutions. That would be really cool. Now, I just want to see a Venusaur after this. That would be really cool. <laughs> I'd enjoy that. And... Oh, another Ivysaur? Ah, oh, that's so anticlimactic. What the heck? I was expecting a Venusaur. I wanted a Venusaur. And you just have these two Ivysaurs? This doesn't even make sense. Oh, oh well. I was strongly considering having, uh, or sending Leaf out for a uh, Venusaur ditto. And that would just been pretty funny. But, nope. Stupid Aroma Lady Violet has to ruin all my fun. Even though she complimented our Pokemon. And me. But I'm used to being complimented. Right. Um... Bailey is still asleep. Let's see if we can do something about that. Do we have an awakening? Yeah, we do. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip that. I don't wanna deal with that right now. And Bailey should clean up this trainer. Yay, yay, Pokemon! Another Krabby. Nah, we're not gonna switch. And I at least want you guys to see this Pokemon. I actually like Krabby a lot. I don't know why. I think it's such a funny looking Pokemon. And it's kind of like cute. And Bailey just leveled up and also learned Thunder Wave. So that's a little highlight from this battle, I guess. Otherwise, there isn't too much. She started off with a Staryu. Let's see what her last Pokemon is. And it's a Staryu. Nothing that special. Sorry, guys, but I at least want to show you a little bit of this battle. Some interesting Pokemans. And then we'll have to switch out Bailey. Uh, for another lead Pokemon so we can spread the wealth of experience yet again. And so we've gone past Bond Bridge, and we're still looking for Lostel in the Berry Forest. And I don't remember who we had to give that Meteorite to, but I went to Island too, and I talked to quite a few people, but yeah, whatever. Alright, so here's Bond Bridge, and there's more and more trainers. Uh, who do we want in the front? Let's go with Cooler in the front. Because these look like Water-type trainers. So let's give this trainer a go. My mommy said that I can't swim without my float ring. Just some polywags and polyworld, not a big deal. But let's see what this lady has. The salty thing of the sea, it tickles my heart. I can give you something salty. Alright, so Cooler got paralyzed in that, which kind of sucks. But are we finally at Berry Forest? Alright, let's see what Berry Forest is looking like. This is the same song as Viridian Forest. Welcome to the Berry Forest. Be friendly and share berries with other po others and Pokemon. Alright, we're going to explore Berry Forest next time. we got to find Lostel and hopefully talk to that guy back on Island Number 2 and that'll let us find the guy to give a meteorite to and we can solve this whole side quest thing. It's a lot of fun. I actually didn't expect to do this, but I hope you guys are enjoy it, enjoying it just as much as I am and I'll see you guys in the next episode. But until then, this has been Midnight Zero and this mission is complete. <laughs>